Well, the answer is ambiguous. Number one, uh, certainly it's difficult. But it's difficult for everyone in our societies now. It's more difficult, I would say, than in former times when I think of my parents. Um, there was not the same level of competition, the same anxiety uh, as uh, we go through now. But this being said, in, uh, in the field of science, you're right. The competition, there are many more young people who want to go into science as uh, there used to be in former times, for one thing. On the other hand, science has become so much more attractive and as I uh, have kept on saying in those days, there's so many more possibilities of approaching uh, the solution of the problems which you ask. Uh, if you ask a question, how do you get along it? In my times, well, my times <laughs> are still going on, <laughs> but still, <laughs> I mean, when I started, uh, there was nearly, there was no, uh, what we did have in Strasbourg was we had very good chemistry analytic chemistry and so on, but there was no biochemistry, no biochemistry, no professor of biochemistry when I uh, went through my studies. There was no molecular biology, of course. There was no molecular genetics, of course. And all this is now so predominant, there was no omics and uh, so I mean, the world has totally changed, at least for life sciences, when you get into life sciences. <laughs> so I think th my that's why my answer is a little bit ambiguous, because uh, on the one hand, there's so many more possibilities, so much more exciting, inspiring, as you have <laughs> kept on saying for the two days now. But on the other hand, the competition is, uh, is relatively tough. I, I agree mm. with that. And the positions, are, the positions have increased, but not in the same proportion as uh, the young people who want to get into it. And this is true for all the countries.